Hi everyone, I'm going to show you some tips and tricks for using Zoom on your iPad. Okay, so when you go to join your teacher's class, you just push the join a meeting button right there. And then if you push this little arrow right here, it shows all of the rooms you went to before, so you don't have to type the number again and again and again. Once you find your teacher's name, make sure it's the right one. You can see the number right there. You push done. Also, you can type, you can change your name right here before you join. Okay? Always remember to change your name when you're coming in so we can see who's coming. Okay? So I'm going to just push the X here. Yours probably says your iPad's name, like a bunch of letters and numbers. And then just type your name. And then when you join in, we can see who you are. Make sure to always use your name for attendance and things like that. Join. Okay, this is the waiting room. Your teacher, when they are ready, they will go ahead and let you in the room. If you're in the waiting room for a little while, that's okay. That means that there might be something going on or the teacher's talking to someone. Um, but they'll get to you eventually, so just stay on the screen until they let you in. And that is going to look like this. And then what I'm going to click is call using internet audio, the one on the top. Okay, every time push that one. One, 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 one. And then we can hear you. Make sure to mute your microphone like I just did when you're coming in unless you have uh, something to say. Okay, right now I can just see um, the teacher's face and then my video on the bottom. Let me turn my video on. To make all my settings come up, I just touch the screen and then they come up. I'll turn on my video. And there's a cool thing. If you want to see everybody in the class, then go over here to this box, this grid, and switch to gallery view. And then you can see everybody in the whole class. Okay? All right. You know how to mute your microphone and to turn on and off um, your video. Ooh. So let's look at one more thing. Actually, two more things. Let's say I forgot to change my name before. Then I can just look right here on participants. You see those people? And then click on those people. And then just touch your iPad, which I think is the one on top usually. And then push rename, and then you can rename yourself. Easy peasy, okay? Rename, type your name, push done. Last thing, do you see these three dots? It says more. If I touch those three dots, I can see all my emojis, okay? So if I push the thumbs up, then it shows up right here, and everyone can see my thumbs up. If someone does something awesome in class, or they say something that you agree with, you can give them a thumbs up or a clap, or something like that. Um, you can also access the chat, which you don't really need unless you have to ask your teacher for help. You don't need it to um, talk to your, your friends during class. Um, so I'll push more and then push chat. And then if I need to send the teacher a question, I'll just click on that little arrow, send to the teacher, and then type my question. All right, I think that's everything that you need to know for Zoom. I hope that you guys enjoy and you learn something new from this video. Thank you.